want a brawl? I'm a coming, I'm a coming. Yeah! Kids today. Today. What is this button? 
just gonna arrest you. Sausage. Hey! Gosh, oh, I'm just gonna rest you. So there you guys go, Gale 1v1 versus every other brawler in Brawl Stars. Not only just the base interactions, but also some other kind of interesting ones using his super and his gadget, which is really crazy. One thing about Gale is that even though he fires five snowballs, it's actually kind of difficult to hit more than two on a consistent basis. Your shot has to be perfect to land three snowballs. If it's not dead center, you're not going to get it. That's why when I was standing there just auto aiming, no problem, I'll hit it. But whenever there's longer interactions not auto-aiming, it's like a 50-50 shot whether I'm going to hit two or three. As for what I feel about Gale, I feel like he's going to be a pretty good support brawler. And that's what he is. He's a support brawler. His pushback and his stun going up against the wall is pretty darn useful with that star power. Also, the jump pad is going to be crazy. There are some insane situations that you're going to be able to get yourself and your team in. Some really cool things that you're going to be able to do like jumping behind a team and bounty and completely pinching them. Now you only get three of them but the jump pad is permanent. The, it's going to be there the entire game until you put down another one. It's quite crazy. Is he completely overpowered? No. He's actually, I'd say, right in the middle of the pack in terms of how much power he has. But his utility is off the charts. He's got tons and tons of utility. So he's going to be really interesting, like I said, as a support brawler. 
I want to know what you guys thought of this style of 1v1s. Do you prefer this or do you prefer the other ones where I talk a whole heck of a lot more? Let me know in the comments down below which one you prefer. And if you are watching this right when it releases, head on over to my stories because I will be doing a Q&A about Gale over there. And the final thing here is use Gold Lex. If you guys are going to be spending any gems in game, if you're going to be getting the Brawl Pass, I would really appreciate, my family would really appreciate your support in using code Lex. And if you don't use my code, hey, you know, use your favorite creator, whoever that may be. Use code Kairos or BT1 or Ray or Pat or OJ, whoever it is. There's no reason not to support somebody. It doesn't cost you anything extra. It doesn't cost you a single cent extra, but in turn, you're helping support somebody else that you enjoy their content. So it only makes sense to use somebody's code, and I would appreciate it if you use code Lex. That's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And as always, until next time, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace out.